North Korea could launch an intercontinental ballistic missile at any time from any location. That is the message from North Korean's foreign ministry official. This came out on Sunday, quoted by KCNA, the state-run media. And they say that the only thing that they're waiting for is the green light from Kim Jong-un, the North Korean leader. Now, also, we hear in this statement that the reason that North Korea has, uh, has found it necessary to carry out and develop this nuclear and missile program is because of Washington, the U.S. hostile policy, as North Korea calls it. And this, of course, is something that they have been saying for years, if not decades, blaming Washington uh, for what they say is their need for self-defense. Uh, now, also on Sunday, we did hear from uh, U.S. Defense Secretary saying on NBC's Meet the Press that this program from North Korea is a serious threat. Also saying that the U.S. military is uh, prepared to shoot down any missile which appears to be heading towards U.S. territory or appears to be heading from the north to any territory of its allies. But one interesting thing from this, uh, this statement that we have been hearing from uh, experts is that it does appear as though North Korea is hoping for a different relationship uh, with President-elect Donald Trump when his administration uh, comes into power. Now, they did say, uh, using uh, the DPRK, the, the official term uh, for North Korea, quote, Anyone who wants to deal with the DPRK would be well advised to secure a new way of thinking after having a clear understanding of it. Now, Kim Jong-un in his uh, New Year's Day address did say that uh, he was potentially close to test launching an ICBM, which uh, would uh, potentially be able to hit mainland US. And then we heard from uh, Donald Trump just a day later in a tweet saying it won't happen. But experts, observers, officials have all noted the fact that North Korea does not appear uh, to be uh, as aggressive when it comes to talking about Donald Trump as it has been in the past when talking about US President Barack Obama or in in fact, uh, South Korean officials and experts say the reason for that is quite simple, uh, that North Korea appears to be taking a wait and see approach uh, as to what exactly Donald Trump's North Korean policy will be, because at this point they simply don't know. Paula Hancock's CNN Seoul.